What is up everyone? So Flo James here. Um today I'm gonna be teaching y'all how to do a cover art. If y'all know how to do a cover art, we're gonna learn today. Uh I guess I'm gonna show I'm gonna teach you real quick is just how to get these textures and uh you know it's all about the fine details. Alright man, so you could pretty much see what we got there. Um real quick, just gonna show you in case you don't know how to chop something out you know grab your pencil right here p shortcut you guys a rough idea of how to do this um if you want that you know paper look like it really got chopped out you know you can just get some real jagged cuts with them anyways so once you got that right click feather you don't want to feather this at all because you want you know clean cut once you got that selection Command or Control C, Command or Control V. That's one way to do it. Or when you have your selection, this you know a lot of people prefer to do it this way. Is you just add a layer mask, and now you know technically your image isn't destroyed. You could always just a brush or some shit. You got a black brush to hide, white brush to show. So your image isn't really destroyed and you can go back and, and tweak that if you want to. So now you know how to cut a fucking image out. You can go back to what I got. Here we have adjustment layers. I wanted to get everything kind of matching. So got a brightness adjustment layer. You could Then I did an uh, exposure one just to really give it that like bright Polaroid feel, I guess. I don't know. Got the car spaceship all right so as you can see that shit was pretty wonky before got a hue and saturation to just dull everything out because that that looks weird next we got the birds in the left corner um uh, now we have our first texture don't really remember where i got it but yeah there we go you know any of these will do you just want to make sure you know you're not stealing pretty sure all this is good I'm not gonna download it from there cuz I'm not gonna use this so I'm just doing it to show you guys so you know if you would have got this the right way it obviously would have been a way better texture screen that bitch and now you have a crumpled paper texture so yeah you won't you really want to make sure you get that the proper way don't just be ripping shit cuz uh you're gonna end up with a shitty texture. I'd really advise you to go and check out like Creative Market. You could probably find some on there or just check on Instagram, man. There's a lot of people selling textures. Or if you really wanna be a graphic designer, just go get yourself a scanner. Start crumpling up shit and scanning it yourself. Probably the best idea. Now we got the track title. This is same shit, just letters cut out. Keep everything organized in case you wanna, you know, maybe I wanted to take this and just move it over here or something next was the money you know i did the same thing as i showed you with the pictures i just got this high quality picture of money use my pen tool cut it out just got that grunge texture and this is literally what high quality textures will do to an image like you know that looks plain jane as fuck the way you can get this to only affect you know the money or whatever on the right click and create a clipping mask and now that texture is only affecting whatever's under it now we threw in you know cigarettes same technique cut them out place them the cigarettes do have a drop shadow actually you can see that with and without and you know, you just play with shit. Now finally we got what makes the image, which is the textures as a whole, which kind of, you know, dull everything down again, get rid of that extra brightness. Polaroid texture. Little marker writing on the bottom of it. And then basically just more, you know, textures we have that got the vinyl to give it that little plastic burn right there 
I feel like that adds a nice touch of realism. Now we got the lighter. Added some tape as well. Tape you can find on Google as well. Just look up tape PNG images. You'll probably get a hundred of those. And then finally we got the vibrance, which again doesn't seem like it does much, but it's just kind of giving everything that last little pop it needs. You can really see it on like the lighters, the red on that, and on the F on the fun. Well, that's pretty much it. A couple uh, things of cutting out, adding some textures, playing with the location of everything, and you got yourself a cover art. Thanks for coming by, and I don't know what else to say here, so I'm probably just going to cut it off. Soft flow records. records.